Hi, I'm Bob Kirk and you're watching Bark and Bones. In this video, I will show you how to take care of your hoods, so I will give you some nice tips in order that you can have them in the best condition possible. Okay, let's start. Okay, so you have different colors, different materials, as this kind of fabric, also the neoprene hoods, and also their kind of designs, as muscles and other kind of animals. Today we are gonna just take care of these kind of hoods. First of all, all hoods have five buttons. One, two, three, four, and five. You can change the muscle. For example, it can be something like this as well. Okay, next thing. Other thing you can do is also you can change how the ears look. Let's make eyes. The ears are really flexible, so you can give different feelings or other kind of shapes and play with them, like this, like this. They're really easy to play with. So this will give different kind of personality to your own puppy. So you can really be very unique in these kind of things. You can also personalize them, like putting some holes here to hear better, you have here in the mouth, you can put your tongue out, drink something, and you can add materials as, for example, this. So, how do we start? I'm gonna teach you first, let's place this side, how to change the buttons. Some people just pull from here, and this is very dangerous because you can break this area if you do it often. So the best way to do it is you place your fingers as close as possible and just do a small piece of string. This is way easier and it's much safer for the hood. So it's very easy to take off. And then, when you are wearing your hood, many people pull from here, from this area, when they want to replace it because they're drinking or talking and the hood usually moves. This is a very, very bad idea because you can break this part. As you can see, this is a little bit broken already. So, never pulling from here. It's much more better. It's much better if you pull just from here. So, in this case, you replace it, pull it from here, and in case it's not enough, you can first push from the back side of your hood up, and then pull from this area, from both sides, down, exactly when, the, when this part is, so you don't push only from one side, breaking it already. Also, when you do this, you have also to take care of your nose, because for example, if you are pulling down from the sides of your chin, if your nose is here, you can do this and you end up breaking this area. And this happens to many, many, many pups. I've seen a lot of them with problems in this area because the nose is already like hitting this spot. And it's kind of an angle, so it's easier to break it than other areas so you have also to take care here like when you see like the limit when you feel just don't over push because otherwise you're gonna break it and this is really difficult to fix another thing is like normally many pops also when they want to take off they pull from here up or from here up or just whatever how i do it is i pull from here i make a space pulling from the sides of my chin 
up so I make space and then I put it out so I take care with this area which is the easier to break and makes the resistance in order not to let it go up and cover your mouth and also you don't pull from your ears because you can break this area or this area so it's easier if you do it that way so the life of your hood will get much longer another thing is how you place them in your bag or whenever you arrive home or something like many pups just do this which for a few seconds is not such a bad thing but if you do it for a long period you will see like the lines how they stay literally forever so it's better if you just put a shirt inside if you don't have a head or something you just put some shirts or whatever you don't use at home and you keep them the and you keep them in the most neutral position possible okay so these were the tips i wanted to give it to you and in case you have some that i know i didn't say or i forgot to say you can always tell them and leave them on messages and don't forget to like subscribe and follow me on different social media as instagram and blah 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 see you in the next video and thank you for watching